Hello and welcome to eMulti Skills video tutorial. In this video tutorial, we will see how to update the max connection settings in MySQL, which is installed on a Windows system. So it is very straightforward uh, step and I'm going to do it. So what is a max connection? So max connection is the number of maximum number of connection that is allowed by the applications or the users to connect with uh, the MySQL instances. So, so this is defined by a value which is called as my underscore connections and uh, it is available in uh, my dot ini. So, so let us first let, let us uh, log into the MySQL instance. So I'm going to log in it as a root user. Let us find out uh, the current value of max underscore connections. So show variable like uh, max underscore connection. So at this point of time, it is 1, 250. By default, it is 151 for uh, uh, 5.6 and uh, this is the default value and over a period of time due to the increase in the number of connections you may have to change it and uh, let's say there is a certain requirement to change it from the default value um, this is not the current default value but i have already modified it to 250 let's say the application has got the error that maximum number of uh, connections exhausted they are not able to connect furthermore and we need to change this value or we need to update this value so on the fly without shutting down on the instance you can change it from uh, this value to some uh, higher level of value let's say from 250 to 300 so without shutting down the instance I can make the changes using this uh, this parameter so let's say I'll just simply say C, uh, set global max underscore connections equal to 300 so what this will do this will uh, change the uh, uh, change the number of connections from uh, 250 to 300 so you will be able to connect with this uh, so uh, another 50 connections will be allowed uh, but when you restart the instant this is the value is not going to remain so this is this is uh, available in the memory as soon as you restart the instance this is going to go off so what I'm going to do is I'll exit out of the prompt so the current setting is uh, 250 250 and I have modified on the fly to 300 and uh, we will verify whether whether this remains alive after restarting the instance or not so let's say I have restarted the instance so once it is restarted like stopping and starting this should not be available so from 250 to 300 we made it so this should uh, this should be the actual value so let's say I'll say show variable like uh, max connection so you can see it has reverted to uh, 250 instead of 300 so this particular value is there in the my.ini but there is a requirement to change it permanently from 250 to 300 so what I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, change it to permanently into uh, my dot ini file so what I'm going to do as of now is I'll copy the complete location and I'll stop the instance stop the instance modify the parameter and then start the instance it is it is very straightforward but how to find out how many number of connections are available so uh, that can be modified it depends upon what kind of uh, uh, memories available and uh, and how many connections can be supported on your on on your system so there, there is a formula available so max underscore corrections you can see it is 250 let's make the permanent changes into my dot ini to 300 and close it start the instance and then we will log in back to the uh, mysql instance just to verify okay this is the instance has restarted and uh, just verify the max underscore connections so you can send, uh, see uh, the value has got changed from 200 and 250 to 300 so this is a permanent change so this is going to be a very very simple demo i think this is going to help and uh, thanks for watching